Hello uh, everyone and welcome to Knights of Honor 2 Sovereign and we're going to talk about how you can uh, defend yourself, participate in a war or declare a war. Uh, today we're playing as Sweden but uh, here we can see our marshal, he's red. Here we can see a leading army, he's stationed near Stockholm. We knew he's in Stockholm but we can also just press on the marshal. I, I I can just click him out and he will uh, come out of the city. But if I want to recruit soldiers, I have to put him inside a city. And then I press uh, on the, the squads. And now you can see I can recruit Nordic peasants. Here we see manpower, stamina, travel, melee, defense, and resilience and siege attack. Uh, how good they are. I also have unlocked a bowman. And you, there you see it requires Fletchers. And that's because we have barracks here, barracks in Stockholm. And uh, here we can see we're getting stables soon enough. So we can get archers, horsemen, <laughs> cavalry. That's the English word. That's just what we can get in this one said building. Not this one uh, building, but in this province. Because I only have barracks in, the, in that city, in Stockholm. I, I now built three archers. Here you can see it's ticking up. We have two out of five workers. So when you create units, it will cost money. It, they will also take upkeep. You can see the upkeep down in the right. That, as I say, they take money. But they will also eat uh, upkeep. No, they eat your workers. And uh, that will be an issue if you need an army fast enough of course you can speed up the, the game speed but it will still take a while but now we have three archers i could take these with me uh, I press on him and we take him out and there we go 1200 it's not um, many beware. many soldiers though crusade is coming so we can go back okay and let's get rid of these uh, notifications the stables are done so here we see we are still lacking spear makers and heavy armor smith. So even we though we can't message. get them yet, and here just spear makers. So now we can uh, make some light cavalry, cost three hundred gold, and uh, here you can see the upkeep is two. I have the money, I have everything, but now we don't have workers. So, but we can take this army. Let's see, how's, how's the Finns doing? And let's see, audience. Now we can declare a war. Sorry, and uh, there, there we go. And uh, what's the worst thing that can happen? Uh, the peasants doesn't like us for attacking Finland. Uh, that, the Kiev, uh, Kievans are pleased. Karelia doesn't like us as well. Um, demand supporting war. Uh, here we can... Uh, Attack kingdom, supporting war. So, for example, here, war between Sweden and Finns. Attack kingdom, Finns. Yeah, here we can ask them for support. Okay, we have to refuse uh, to fight, but yeah. Wish. Overlook of the fight. There is no one uh, leading in the enemy army, and uh, lift siege. And here we, we can assault. Here is uh, the su supply. Uh, here we can uh, see a siege defense, resilience, defender food, and how many units they have left. And when we're raiding here, we are getting loot. And uh, we, we, we kind of wanna want them to break their morale. Our queen has given birth ah, look at that, a beautiful, beautiful uh, thing. We've and hold the feast. Ah, look at the, all the good Sire, things. The peasantry is delighted with our yeah, everyone is delighted with us. Maybe not the Finns, though. Actions. I'm just spending money uh, on everyone. <laughs> but the Finns. <laughs> hmm. So yeah, we'll take a while. I don't have a siege equipment uh, in this army, though. And there we go, now we have some. So let's go and plunder the next one as well. So 
this way we can get some supplies. Um, not great. So yeah, you saw we were fighting like t uh, 200 men. That's like the basic uh, defense. And when they're defeated, the pillaging is taking place. And here we can stop plundering. Lastly, I want to see if we can fi uh, find the Finnish army. Supply stolen, 80. I am ready. So, as you can see, by going and pillaging uh, nearby farmland, you can uh, stay longer on uh, your mission to attack. Also, when, uh, when you're building your armies, you should uh, try to, to have a setup so uh, you counter your enemies. For example, uh, they may have... Uh, maybe a, a lot of peasants then you, if you have uh, tons of archers you will uh, have uh, the upper hand uh, you could also uh, for example have uh, cavalry but if you know your opponent will have cavalry you need to have spearmen so that's that and uh, there is also some terrain modificators uh, modica uh, as well so that you have to think about that as well and when uh, you are fighting in a city you really need siege weapons because it will take forever and uh, here we can see a little bit of the setup what they have here we see peasants peasants and moving it towards light cavalry so by setting our mouse on the, these icons, we see uh, what's happening. So yeah, here's the enemy army. Enemy forces have stopped our pillaging. And now we can choose to choose all in, and it will out of the side. But and you here we see a timer and a heavily one-sided. Uh, troops tier, uh, rank, counter factor, we have a little bit, and we both are pretty good. We're balanced, they're ranged. So let's see how it looks when we, we will lead. This will be an easy battle. So this is, um, if you compare it to Crusader Kings, this is uh, what's uh, a little bit different. It's a little bit uh, total of war ish, and that you can uh, control your own troops. We were gathering what was rightfully ours. When we were attacked by these craven cowards, holding these capture points can grant us a decisive victory. And uh, here we can see, and uh, overall morale, and uh, you can't pause here. So my life is precious. Awaiting orders. Uh, let's see way. now. Here we are. Go there. What should we do? Go to that position. There we go. Uh, first time doing this. Let's go. <laughs> Bowmen ready. Ready to fight. Okay, there we have some archers. I must be well protected. And uh, we will uh, of course try to flank. Prepare to ride, men. Enemy cavalry incoming. We're being flanked. Strong! Pierce them, men! I'm in charge here! Okay, so they're uh, kind of avoiding. The cowards are fleeing! Okay, and uh, we go back there. Incoming. Oh, we never can mark them. 
Okay, high value target, so they will uh, maybe target uh, him if possible. And uh, now these will uh, attack archers from behind. And there we go. And uh, uh, we will uh, go for, the, uh, for them. What should we do? Hit him hard. Ready to fight. Blood and steel. Yes. Bash their heads in. I'm oh yeah. And, uh, the, what we can, what we really should be doing is to, to capture down. those flags. So, if we uh, would want to. Could do we that. No shields for these arrows. But, yeah, the what he is actually is doing right now point. is uh, capturing uh, one of the points. No one runs. We're under attack. Uh, and that's tricky. I'm in charge here. Destroy the foe. There we go. So you could uh, check on this map. How does it go? At your command. Prepare to ride, men. And we take these guys, the light spearmen. A hostile capture point is being taken. The enemy has taken our capture point. And as you can see, it goes rather quick. Yes. At your command. We are on our way. Oh no! <laughs> we can't get outfricked uh, by the Finns again. Capture point is contested by the enemy. We've taken the enemy's capture point. Okay, there we go. We must protect our leader from the enemies. Attack with caution. Okay, and now attack them. They have archers. Ready to fight. Oh yeah, uh, I really hope it, to ride, they can't take it. Meanwhile, it's contested. We are our capture point. Oh, well, it's regaining. We are securing a hostile capture point. The enemy troops are losing hope quickly. I really hope so. Ready to fight. Fight faster. Slaughter the enemy. You're under attack. Oh, yeah, we're getting slaughtered. Once again. Our men taking all capture points. We secured the area and, and there we go. We can also replay if we want to. And or we just continue. We are pro now. But yeah, that's a little bit of battle. We've captured a foreign knight, sire. And uh, here we have the knight. I will kill the guards in this dungeon. And we can uh, deal. He will join us. Oh, look at the money we're having right now. Sweden and it makes so much more money than Finland, by the way. Uh, a release. Or we can just execute. Whoopsie do. Hmm. Shit happens. If you are a character of Sweden, you will not decline. <gasps> oh yeah, they threaten us so much. But yeah, now they don't have that uh, army defending no them. So no we... So we can see how this uh, plays out. But here they have another army that we should uh, watch out for. And they attack. Sire, our pillaging was interrupted by hostile forces. And slightly one-sided. And we will get our asses kicked. But yeah. When you're doing these fights. You should have multiple armies. And uh, we could have another army leader as well. With uh, different uh, abilities that will boost the entire army. But yeah. Yeah. Uh, that that is pretty uh, well done for uh, Finland to have two armies that quick. Hmm. But yeah, uh, we could uh, quite easily form another army and uh, get it going. But that's basic army handling. And 
you can also, when you're sieging city, um, choose between uh, crossing and assault. Here we have retreat from battle, but uh, when you're sieging, there is an assault option as well when they have broken down. Um, I will also want to point out you have to <laughs> <laughs> really be careful when waging war because you know never what will happen. But yeah, I hope this helped you to get going. And thank you for watching and see you in my next video. Bye.